Why do people take photos? The two things it says when I get my printed photos back are enjoy your memories and enjoy the colour. Now I think this is really accurate because photos just are memories and they literally are just colour arranged in a way that is meaningful. But what would it mean to capture the perfect image? Maybe the perfect image isn't even an image at all. Maybe it's a drawing, a stone carving, a digital photograph. Maybe it's a printed photo. Maybe it's a raw photo. Maybe a movie, a film, animation. Maybe it's inscriptions on walls. Whatever it is, they're all created to serve a purpose. All these photos, all these memories, they've been kept so that we can remember them. Or do we do it to tell a story? But the real question is, why? Karl Lagerfeld, one of the most influential fashion designers said, what I like about photographs is that they capture a moment that's gone forever, impossible to reproduce. Is this why we take photos? To capture the moments in time that we will never be able to see again. Moments of things that we just love to do. Or moments that we can't see. All these things that we enjoy, we only get to do them for a limited amount of time. We take photos of the things that we love so that we can remember the way we felt about them in that moment. There are infinitely many moments. Why do we choose to capture the ones that we do? Where would we find the perfect image? If you pointed your camera any direction, what would make that image better? Would the photo be of any specific person? Who's to say that one person would be better than another? How would you decide who to choose? So many different variables. How could you ever find what the perfect photo is? What camera would you actually use? What time of day would it be? Would it be sunny, rainy, or none of the above and be something completely different? Something that you would never expect. Abraham Lincoln noted that there are no bad pictures. That's just how your face looks sometimes. A photo really can't be said to be good or bad because it's just a representation of what happened at that moment from the camera's perspective. If you boil down exactly what an image is, one of the most famous painters of recent times said, I know very well that not a single flower was drawn, that they're just little licks of color, red, yellow, orange, green, blue, violet, but the impression of all these colours against one another is nonetheless there in the painting, as it is in nature. Said by Vincent van Gogh, An image is just pixels and particles of colour that happen to be arranged in a way that is meaningful to whoever is looking at it. So colour has the primary role in photo. Red, rose, green, blue, amber, green, green, white, violet. Yellow. So many different colours, so many different possibilities for photos. You could be taking photos for your entire life and never find the one. Maybe it's just up to interpretation. Maybe your favourite photo is what is the perfect photo. Maybe it's not the same for everybody. Maybe a photo of blackness, darkness, absence of anything would be the perfect photo.